Hello, I'm Simon Whistler. You're watching the Today I Found Our YouTube channel, and in the video today, we're looking at why are those balls in gyms called medicine balls? Medicine balls, for those of you who haven't been to a gym or never accidentally kicked one thinking that it was a soccer ball, are heavily weighted balls coming in a variety of sizes and weights, with the biggest we could find ringing in at a whopping 150 pounds with a diverse range of fitness applications. But why exactly are they called medicine balls when, at its core, a medicine ball is just a big, heavy ball? For starters, medicine balls are noted to be one of the most diverse pieces of exercise equipment one can known, useful for toning almost every part of the body, and are also extensively used in various forms of physical therapy. While details are sparse on the history of medicine balls, we can reliably trace their usage back around 3,000 years, where they were used by Persian wrestlers looking to become stronger. In ancient Greece, Hippocrates considered them to be an essential tool for helping injured people regain mobility, and he advised people to use them as a general, all purpose way of remaining healthy. This all brings us back to the origin of the name. The word medicine was long synonymous with the word health. For example, it's noted that Renaissance physician Hieronymus Mercurialis advised people of all fitness levels to use what we would recognize as medicine balls, and he did this in his book De Art Gymnastica, as part of what he called medicinal gymnastics. The use of the word medicinal in this case was to highlight how the exercises could be used as both a way of healing injuries and preventing them in the first place through general fitness. Although devices we would recognize as being medicine balls have been commonplace for millennia, the word itself is only a few hundred years old, being attributed to one Professor Roberts way back in 1889. According to a Scientific American article from the time, Roberts coins the term medicine ball in reference to the fact that using the ball invigorates the body, promotes digestion, and restores and preserves one's health. As health and medicine were considered to be synonymous terms at the time, calling it a medicine ball was natural enough. Today we still refer to medicine balls as such, even though the terms health and medicine aren't as synonymous as they once were. Health ball also doesn't quite have the same ring to it. So I really hope you found that video interesting. If you did, please give us a like below. It really helps out. And as we are a new channel, we would really appreciate if you share this video with some friends. If you click the share button below, you'll see a whole load of sharing options. And just one of those would really help out. If you want to do more than that, that would be amazing. Also, other videos on the screen that you might enjoy if you enjoyed this one. And don't forget to subscribe. Big button on the screen now. And I am aware if you're on a mobile device, of course, you can't click on the screen as YouTube is currently set up. So there will be links in the description and thank you for watching.